Hey guys, how's it going? A little vlog today. It's uh, January 2nd, 2017. Happy New Year. It's the first video of the year. It's a uh, quarter to three in the afternoon. I got up pretty late today and my mother says that she can still see the night before on my face. Yeah, well, let's just say I got fucking plastered. New Year's Eve. <laughs> It was a good time. I don't think I need to drink that much again. So, yeah, you know, with that, I wound up waking up late yesterday, going to bed late last night. I woke up 8.30 today to call my friend and give his probably kind of still drunk ass directions to the parking garage from our friend's house so he could go get his car before 9 o'clock so he wouldn't be hit with a ticket. Now, I... Well, yeah, and then after that I went back to bed, now woke up, I think, not quite 1.30, but damn close to it. I just left the house, I'm going to my storage unit to get my tools, and then uh, I'm going to go, go change a battery for another friend. So stick around, we'll see what we get up to, hopefully I get enough daylight to do all this shit, because the uh, sun still sets early, although the days are getting longer. Believe it or not. Dirk Kinnaman. Ah, long time since you've seen this, eh? This is where she sits in her slumber waiting for uh, the come and rescue her. I got all the windows open and the trunk and the hood open just to air everything out because uh, mice got in here and it really fucking stinks. In fact, the whole unit stinks a bit because of this. But I dropped off what I need to drop off. Those are some books for it. That's a hook cable for it. And uh, I just need to get those out of my room because I was going to lose my shit. If I need to keep moving them around. And this stuff here is what I came to get. Oh, wonderful. Well, at least it didn't fall far. Well, hopefully I don't need that one. The friend that I'm going to see, he has the same toolkit we bought at the same time. Um, so, any sizes that we need that are missing from this one, because this kit sucks, is uh, going to be something that he has. I like this one better. It's just smaller and a lot more convenient. This one sucks. Anyways, oh damn, both the same size. Uh, yeah, so that's a look and an update on this whole thing. Sure do miss driving her. Well, she ain't getting any worse. Uh, well, I got my tools I needed. Made me realize that I think I'm missing a tool kit. Which sucks, but oh well. The tool kit that I'm missing was better than the piece of crap Walmart special one that I've got going right now. God damn do I miss driving that thing. That's just the way it goes, I guess. Looks like, based on the way the snow is in this parking lot here, which isn't plowed very good, it looks like I'm the only one that has gone to visit their unit, so to stay. Although, what's, one thing that's great about having a unit is, say I start buying parts to fix the car with, I have a place to store them. You know, that's fucking fantastic in itself. I don't have to store them in there neatly. I can just, you know, pile them all top, all over the car, like I do with those two boxes. I just throw them on top. I hate fuck it. <clears throat> if there was any mice in there, they're dead now because there's no food, no water. It's cold. Good riddance to them, some motherfuckers. Now I gotta head down the road a bit, bang a left, bang another left, go through a little cul-de-sac, and I'll be at my other friend's house to change his battery. So. Uh, get there when we get there well now it's dark out and I wanted to make a how-to video on changing that battery but fuck 
That fucking thing was so corroded so badly that, oh, it was just a nightmare to get it out. The, the bolt that holds the bracket hold the battery down was absolutely just rusted in there so fucking bad. I was hammering and hammering and hammering on an Allen wrench stuck through my socket to try and get it out for like a good 20 minutes or so with no success. I mean, I have two two sets of sockets, so, you know, it worked, but I just, you know, wound up. When we went there, we bought some new bolts because uh, that, was, that was just stupid how stuck in it was. So, replaced that bolt, bought a new uh, battery clamp, but the old one is corroded onto the wire so badly that I could not get it off. I didn't want to keep fucking with it. There's really not much wire for me to, you know, just cut it off, put the new, uh, the new thing on and on the cable and, you know, be able to put it back on the battery. So, I have to get that off the way it is. So, I'm going to have to hit it with some PB blaster or something at some point. As for now, because that clamp is so bad, I had to just leave it loose. I mean, the car starts, but it's loose, so that's not good. Hopefully it lasts until Wednesday when I can fuck around with it some more. But it's gonna suck because, you know, here it is, it's six o'clock now, it's been dark for an hour. So, I don't know, just pisses me off. And that's why, kids, you don't let your battery terminals get that bad. The battery was only four years old. So, not too impressed with it, if I do say so myself. Anyways, guys, uh, I think I'm going to wrap this vlog up for today. And it's unfortunate that I didn't get to make a how-to video, but there was just going to be no fucking way with how, how fucked up that was. So, I'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye.